Today, we're going to be busting all of the brand new Season 3 myths in Fortnite. For example, currently right now behind the waterfall in the new POI, there is this event going on where we all have to break this rock. It has five trillion health, okay? Each pickaxe does 50. But can we get in using shockwave grenades? Oh, it did some damage, but no. What about cow catchers? No. But what about cow catchers on a car? Yeah, it does damage, but it's not breaking it completely. Oh, here, I'll just shockwave it. There we go. Oh! Uh, well, that's one way of doing it. I thought it was patch, but yeah, if you shockwave the car into the rock, I think that's like a surefire way of getting it done. Five trillion health? Not for me. Straight in we go. And we've got the NPCs from the last chapter. There's always something in Fortnite to break something. That's just one of the myths we have here today. Make sure to stick around and watch them all because some of them will definitely surprise you. Our OG POIs back in Fortnite. Kinda. We got these iconic POIs from chapter two and chapter one of Fortnite in the bottom left of the new Fortnite map. We have the shark POI. We have the chair POI. And we have one of the sheds from Dusty Depot. The blowing up emote from the battle pass when you use it in game and your you know character posts a photo you start getting these likes and i think it goes to an infinite amount let's find out we could be here a while also there is a tornado on the way consider this emote a reminder to like the video as well all right up some likes on ig let's go check out some other myths can you one shot with the two shot if both of them are right on the head 1990. So this is the purple one. I believe the gold one still does 95-95. So no, you can't. In comparison, the purple striker does 180. So they both do the same damage, but this one just requires extra steps. I think I know which one I'm taking. I hate to see it, but like, it's just better. If you spend too much time in the storm now, you get something called storm sickness. Will this instantly eliminate you? I have yet to experience the effects. Start the timer now. I mean, I've been bouncing on these mushrooms for like four minutes in zone now. I'd say these kind of replenish indefinitely. I'd say it's true. Here we go. I'm now getting it. You're afflicted. So it looks like it's doing 15 ticks on top of it. Oh no. Oh, I missed. So yeah, it hurts. It does 15 ticks plus the actual storm damage. Hey, yo. Heal game kind of nerfed, but also seven minutes. So that means you're really trying to, to be cheeky with it. Now in the new season, you can ride boars and wolves, but can you crank 90s with them? Let's find out right here. Oh, yo, let's go. It is kind of stupid, but yes, you can. Now, do boars and wolves eat the fall damage for you if you are potentially sky basing? This, this could be a sky based metal. Let's see if uh, we both die or just him. Just him. Ayo, Skybase has just been buffed. Thank you, Mr. Boar. This next myth is quite interesting. If you go to the item shop and go support a creator, type in a code LOCKY, hit accept, and then purchase your favorite skins that you were going to buy anyway, then I will receive 5% kickback. True, that does happen. If you want to support me as a creator, make sure to use code Lockie. All righty, that's 100k likes. I'm starting to think this will go forever. So obviously, Covert Canyon is now the rave cave, but you can still access the vault down here with all the loot still here. So I'm not going to lie. This may look set up, but this is the first time I've done this. You don't need a key card. You've got three chests. You don't have the IO chests, but you still have two supply crates. This place is still goaded. Is Clombo back? Obviously, they teased it at the end of the last season that Clombo was going to come back, and he did in one way or another. You hate to see it, really. Can I please have some respectable Fs in the comment section for, for our boy Clombo? Here, get out of the way, man. Show some respect. I wonder if I can put a bot in there. <laughs> this bot is trapped forever in Clombo. <laughs> Here, I'll give you a friend, buddy. There you go. And you can live in Clombo forever. Did you see me in the latest Fortnite trailer? It's like opening scene right here, Cuddle Bear up on the mountain. And if you pause right here... Wait a minute. Go right. Enhanced section A6. Enhanced? Stop. There I am. I made a Fortnite trailer. I don't think any of the icon skins made it though. Oh, okay. Yeah, no. Ninja definitely got enough movement there. Fair play. Is there a free secret emote to unlock right now? This is true. All you have to do is link your Twitch and Epic account and watch your favorite power streamer on Twitch for half an hour. Then go twitch.tv slash inventory and claim your free emote. I'm not gonna lie, the emote kind of fire, especially because it's free, but you've only got like two days to do it. So get watching on Twitch. If you're mounting an animal and jump on another one, you can double mount. 
Yeah, not, not a thing. This one isn't new this season, but if the tires are shot out, you can repair them with a repair tool, like instantly. I didn't know that was a thing. And it even works for chonker tires as well. Like, that's sick. Can we ride the new tameable mobs on launch pads? Yes, we can. They don't glide, but you can, and they don't take fall damage. Can you ride the new mobs onto the slipstream? Let's find out. No, you can't. Damn, that's no fun at all. I'm gonna see if they're sure about this one. Yeah, they are. Wow, it's kind of lame. But what about sharks? What are we saying about the sharkies? Yeah, I'm on it, but he's not. Yo, I'm still on it. <laughs> Sorry, Miles. Oh, wow, you actually got me too. Yikes. You may have noticed these mushrooms around the map in the new season. When you jump on them, you go very high. But do you also heal when you jump on them? I'm on 56. And now I am on 71. So they heal you 15 health per. And it looks like they go under cooldown after you jump on them. So you can't get like infinite heals. You get like one per jump. But do they recharge and are able to be used again? Yes, they do. So you can kind of get like full shield at POIs like this by just jumping on them over time and getting back up to full health. Not a bad trick at all. You can ride a boar. You can ride a wolf. But can you ride a llama? This is what everybody needs to know. And this needs to happen. All right, please, Fortnite. Come here, boy. All right, let me try and knock him out first. Now let me ride. No, no, they didn't do it. No. Alrighty, Myth. Hyper Run by Power Create is one of the most fun and enjoyable maps to play in Fortnite. Now, this one is biased, but it is true. It's like a fun parkour game. And we're going to be doing a sick competition on the Power Discord. I'm going to be doing my own full fledged video on it soon as well. But if you're looking for something else to play this season of Fortnite, Hyper Run is kind of one of the most satisfying parkour games you can play. It's funny because the guy who has the best time is in my game right now. He's trying to crack his new record. GG, man. Keep going. On. Map codes on screen and in the description if you guys want to play. And make sure to like the map while you're there. All right, so these boulders are placed around the map. And you can actually use them similar to the trees where you can destroy them. And they will, I think, move to the closest enemy around you and uh, destroy them. I think this is, like, based off Indiana Jones. Because, obviously, like, he runs away from the ball and he's in the battle pass, like, in the movies. Now, after the boulder is destroyed, can you hit it? Yes, you can. D okay, yo came in like a wrecking ball. I think this thing can break pretty much everything. Honestly, that is a nice boulder. If you climb it to the top of the tree in Reality Falls, you actually get glider redeploy. Let's see. So I think we hit these shrooms. There we go. That is quite the rotation there. Kind of a god POI with that type of rotate. Not gonna lie. You can destroy the graffiti on a launch pad by simply hitting it. See? It's just like a spray. Ballers are back, but they now use fuel. And every time you actually use your grapple, it consumes some of the energy as well. The question is, can we fuel it up with fuel? No, we can't. But can we recharge the baller by going on these little pads that they spawn on? I for sure thought that was going to work. Like, I thought there was going to be a charging pod. Can you use a repair tool to repair your baller? Yes, you can. But it still says at the same amount of charge. Get out of here, boy. I mean, it has a, like a battery symbol. Maybe you need like the Zapatron. I don't know. Can the boulders ride the new geysers? Here we go. Oh, they actually can. Epic. Does anything happen if you shoot the zero point? Well, one, the shark might try and grief you. But does anything happen if we shoot it? No, it doesn't seem to go through the water. But what if we're under the water when we shoot it? Oh, nothing seems to happen. Can you shockwave with a mount? Yes, you can. And you can jump to get extra distance as well. It's actually kind of clean. Very clean. Can you one-shot headshot this season with a heavy sniper rifle? All right. Bit of point of contention. Everybody wants one-shot headshots. 198 is going to be the figure. But there is a mythic heavy sniper in the files right now that will deal 203 headshot damage. It's speculated that we might get these out of the reality tree seeds once they grow to the mythic state. Also, there will be a mythic two-shot shotgun. This might also deal 200 total, but we don't know. Did shockwave grenades get buffed? Kind of. If you actually shockwave now in the new season and instantly slide, 
you slide way faster like you carry a lot of that momentum this also works with gliding as well but for shock waves i consider this like a buff especially in zero build when you're trying to get around a lot like that extra bit of movement speed is gonna help oh it seems i have attracted a irl follower hello mr crow so if you guys saw the trailer obviously darth vader was a boss on the map he will be a boss later in this season and he will have a mythic lightsaber that you can throw he's not in the game right now but he will be soon Alrighty, but what about a boulder? Can this break this bad boy too? Oh, it actually... I actually can. Multiple ways in. Just gotta think outside the box. Are the choke cannons back this season? Yes. If you eliminate a llama in the latest season, you do get a guaranteed choke cannon. Uh, you also get, you know, heals, shockwaves. I'm getting a lot of shockwaves lately from these llamas. Uh, yeah, llamas are buffed. Come with a choke cannon once again. Of course, heal 15 per. Llamas are back in full force. This one's kind of like a bonus myth. I, I just found it kind of accidentally. In Greasy Grove, you know, obviously you can break like kind of everything, like, you know, bushes and, and all that fun stuff, right? But for some reason, this bush right here, you can't break. And I have no idea why. There is no logical reason. Wait, it has these things growing on it. So does this. But I can break it. But I can't break this one. Yeah, so for some reason, any hedge with this thing cannot be broken. But can it be broken with a car? No, it can't. It's actually indestructible. But can we burn it? We can't. What is with this thing? What about shockwave? Bro, this thing is indestructible. Like, actual bruh moment. Incredible, really. So after you plant your reality sapling, every time you pick the weeds around it, it will actually accelerate the growth and then it will go to the next stage. So right here i've just upgraded it and it's gone straight to epic fruit and if i wait another 21 hours it'll go to legendary and then mythic so in the cinematic fortnite trailer you can see a guy is getting towed by a boat which has never been possible before so can we do it in the new season no how did he do it all right you can't tow yourself in the new season like what, what did you know? Another trailer clickbaited us. Nothing new here. All right, are we about to hit a million likes? Is this going to be the end? No, it's not. It keeps going. It keeps going. Can you rift while riding one of the new animals? Okay, he got kicked out of his and one of them died. One of them got rifted again. And now he's dead. Um, no. I mean, he can, but like, it ain't gonna do, it ain't gonna do much for you. Can we ride a boar or wolf as a prop? It's not looking likely. In fact, it ain't looking doable at all. It's kind of sad, really. But what if we buy it while on the boar? Come here, boy. Make me a prop. Ah, uh, kicks you off. That's no fun. That's no fun. Can I, wait, can you mantle? Oh, you can. That's sick. So if my reality tree is damaged, can I repair it with a repair torch? No. And I think if I keep going, I'll probably burn it. I'm not trying to find out that one. Can you put a choke cannon in your tent? You cannot. It is not a stashable item. I believe this is probably because it takes up two slots. So yeah, can't keep the choke cannon. Denied. <laughs> The block is back in Fortnite. Kinda. It's not in yet, but in Tilted Towers, there are these construction zones that I believe are gonna be allotted for a block. I don't know if there's gonna be three different blocks or if it's just one block in different zones, but the block is coming to Tilted Towers this season, and you best believe Power Create are gonna be submitting something. If you guys have any ideas what we should build for the block, tweet us at Power Create. Are the Spider-Man Mythics back in Fortnite? No, they're not. But there is this new grappler that is in the trailer and will come out later this season that kind of it looks like it so something to look forward to i guess all right here we go 10 million surely this is the cap oh it is it, 10 million so it goes to 10 million that was a waste of time and it resets but it was worth the payoff yeah it does have a cap it's 10 million ratio